Welcome to Della Fox Checks and today I'm making my way to the Brea Mall and the reason I'm coming over here is because there's a California Pizza Kitchen inside of there and that's where I'm gonna go eat today. So the reason I'm going to California Pizza Kitchen today is because I went to Costco the other day and I love Costco. Maybe I'll do a video of me shopping there because I love going there but they had a deal on some gift cards for California Pizza Kitchen. So the deal was that you got two gift cards with a combined value of $100 and you only had to pay $80 so that technically means that you got $20 for free I know $20 is not a lot but like for a person that's always eating out in the street like $20 is like it starts to add up right so anyway I decided this is a great excuse to go buy some food at California Pizza right so today I'm gonna eat over here at the mall I'm gonna check out this place last time I was in this mall I actually went to a spot called Kura Revolving Sushi Bar and it was okay, like it was basically cheap sushi. And obviously when you get cheap sushi, like it's not bad, but it's not amazing. It's just right. I think I gave the place like a three or four, but it was also a good spot to come to, why not? But today I'm gonna be checking out the mall also because last time I came, I didn't really explore it. After I eat, I'm also gonna go to the AMC movie theater because I'm gonna go see this movie called Malignant, which is a scary movie and it looks pretty good. So I'll tell you guys how that is at the end of the video. The Instagram for the restaurant is CPK and they have over 47,000 followers. And I like this first picture right here. It's a picture of someone who bought a taken baked pizza. Basically, this is like a pre-made pizza and you take it home to your oven and you put it in and it gets made. I do want to make a video on how these pizzas taste because I've never actually tried one. And they do also have a picture for some mixed drinks because they do sell mixed drinks at CPK and I might be buying one today. And finally, I like this picture that they put on September 30th. They were like regular CPK and then the next day, like a uh, witch came and stole the palm tree from CPK so she could use it as a broom. So I did like this picture and I thought it was pretty funny. I have been wanting to come to this improv comedy place right here on the corner, but I have yet to come. And I actually have been looking at their schedule to see what comedian calls my attention so I can come check them out, but no one has come yet. But I do wanna come soon so I can share my experience with you guys of how that place is. They do comedy every single weekend and I'm dying to be there so they can make me laugh. And every time I pass through the food court section of the mall, I love it because there's so many different smells and they all catch my attention. I smell burritos, tacos, food, Chinese food, and much, much more, right? But right now, this is right here where the mall is at. This is where Kuro Revolving Sushi Bar is at. This is where I came last time to eat some sushi. I think I gave that place like a four out of five, so if you wanna see that video, check it out. And also, the CPK is right next door, so today, we're gonna go to CPK to try out some food from this restaurant to see how it is. I haven't come to CPK in years. Let me repeat that. I haven't come here in years. Last time I came, I believe it was like five years ago, but I have not come yet. Cause before I used to do YouTube, I never really went out to eat anywhere. Like I kind of always ate Subway or I cooked at home. So this is a menu for CPK and uh, this is how it looks. I do like the pizza on the front cover. I don't know if avocate goes on pizza though. I know there's this debate about like Hawaiian pizza, but <sighs> Does avocado go on pizza? I don't know, but the menu right here, it looks really nice. I do like that they have a lot of pictures and they do have a lot of options for you guys. As you can see on the left-hand side, they have some pictures and on the right-hand side, they have the name of the stuff that they have. And to get us started today, they gave us some bread and the bread was so good. It was a little bit hard, just a little bit, but it was soft, you know? But other than that, it was pretty good. I did like it. I did like dipping the oil in the bread or the bread in the oil because it made it taste a lot better. Of course, the bread is just a bunch of calories, but I mean, this is what I'm out here doing. I'm out here eating to fill my stomach, and right now, I'm dipping the bread in the oil because I wanna see how it tastes. It's supposed to be on a diet, but they keep giving me bread. For my drink today, I got something called a beehive sangria, and this basically had a sweet blend of white wine, 
Kanchu, Morning Lavender, Perfect Peru Strawberry, Honey, and Lemon. And I gotta say, this thing did not disappoint. I love the way it tasted. Like, it was sweet, but not really. And you could kind of taste the alcohol. Of course, this drink is not gonna get you messed up or tipsy or anything. It's really just to enjoy while you eat your food. And I really did like it. It was pretty good. And I wanted to order another one, but I did have to drive, so only one for me today. For my appetizer, I ordered some avocado club egg rolls and this is basically hand wrapped crispy wonton rolls that are filled with avocate, chicken, tomato, Monterey Jack and some smoked bacon and of course they give you some sauces on the side and this thing was actually really good as an appetizer. I really did enjoy biting into it because every time I would bite into it, I could taste the chicken, the bacon and the avocate which is my favorite part. Of course you can also taste the cheese but these things do fill you up so if you order these, make sure you order them when you're with a group or if you you order these only eat like one or two because if you eat more than that I feel like you're gonna get full and you're not gonna enjoy your main meal but other than that this is a good appetizer to order With your egg rolls, they give you two sauces. They give you ranch and chipotle, and they both taste really good with the egg rolls. But me personally, I did like the ranch a lot more, but that's just a personal preference. I'm gonna be trying out the Hawaiian pizza and of course this is the famous debate of does pineapple and ham go on pizza but uh, it's a personal preference you guys honestly I love Hawaiian pizza it tastes really good there's just something about ham and pineapple that tastes so bomb and uh, the pizza does not disappoint from here of course me personally I'm not gonna lie I'd rather eat Domino's pizza but the CPK pizza does have its own unique flavor which is something I like and I did like the pizza from here the Hawaiian pizza does taste pretty good Salute. Oh no, this is a pizza, huh? the chicken piccata and this thing was so good you guys I love this more than the pizza and one of the reasons why I loved it was because it had lemon so this is basically some chicken with pasta and of course it has the Italian sauce and one of the things I like is that the Italian sauce is mixed with lemon so every time you're biting into the chicken you're tasting lemon and that's one thing I love because it makes the chicken not taste so dry right because this is white meat white meat is usually dry but because they use some Italian sauce and some lemon it tastes a lot better and the pasta is really soft and delicious this this is my favorite plate from today. I really loved it. Let's see how the plate is. The chicken. Pretty good. It's nice and juicy. Let's see how the pasta is. And today, I went to go see a movie called Malignant. This is a horror movie. And the reason I came to see it is because Halloween is like a couple of weeks away. And I kind of want to get in that Halloween spirit, right? That scary feeling type of feel. So today, I went to go see this movie. And I was a little skeptical when I went to go see it. I was a little like, ah, I don't know if it's going to be good. Because the trailers were kind of iffy. But wow, this movie turned out to be really good. And it had an amazing plot twist. that I really, really liked. Because I didn't see it coming. But other than that, the movie was awesome. I recommend it for anybody who likes horror movies. On Yelp, California Pizza Kitchen has three stars with 547 reviews. Me personally, I don't think that this place deserves to have three stars. At least it should have four. But I mean, that's what the people have voted for. Me, I'm gonna give this place a five out of five. And the reason it's getting a five was because I loved everything that I ate today. My mixed drink was good. The aguacate rolls were good. 
the pizza was good and the chicken picada was amazing that was my favorite thing from the menu honestly if you come to cpk get that chicken picada because that thing is bomb especially if you're a big fan of lemon you're gonna love it if you don't like lemon that much then you're probably not gonna like it right but if you're a fan of lemon make sure you get it because it tastes really good the pasta was good the chicken was good today my visit at cpk was awesome i had a great server and i will be coming back to cpk in the future to try something else out because they do have a ton of stuff in their menu and if you enjoyed this video do me a favor and hit that delicious like button down below and also if you want to keep going on some awesome adventures with me make sure to subscribe i post new videos every single week showing you some awesome places you're gonna want to check out this was Bella Fox checks and i approve of california pizza kitchen